Hi, welcome to Knit with Hannah. Today we're looking at six ways you can get paid to knit. Hi, welcome to Knit with Hannah. I'm Hannah, I'm here with Knitting Matter to help you learn to knit the easy way. Today we're talking more about profitable knitting how you can make money for your knitting expertise, your talent and all that time that you put into your knitting. So let's look at six ways we can do this. First of all, if you're new, make sure that you subscribe because I've got one more video coming up for you about profitable knitting. And if you hit the little bell, you've been notified when that one appears on my channel. I'm here every week, every Tuesday with new videos. And yeah, I'd love to have you join me for more knitting matter. Right, so let's look at those six ways that you can sell your knitting and get some profit from your knitting. The first most obvious way is to sell your finished knits. If you love knitting, if you love knitting so much that you want to create your own collection of knitwear, um, be that by using patterns that you're allowed to sell from or that by designing your own patterns and knitting those up to sell, then go for it. That's a great way to do it and I'll give you more tips on that in the video last week. The second way is to take commissions. You can say, I knit jumpers for toddlers, this is the pattern or these are the three patterns that I'll knit from. Um, give me lots and lots of money and I will knit them up for you. The best idea really is to make sure that you're in charge of what you're knitting and then they come to you and ask you to knit it up rather than them bringing you lots of patterns and lots of yarn because the yarn might not be ideal for the pattern. If they're not knitters, they may not know it. The pattern may have flaws in it so that you knit it up and it doesn't quite fit. There could be so many dis discrepancies that you're not aware of. So if, if you're in charge and you create the rules, then it makes a lot easier for you. The third way you can create money from your knitting is to knit up samples for yarn shops. Sometimes when a whole new collection of yarn comes in, it can be quite confusing for the customers to look at the yarn and say, what does it look like in a fabric? Um, so a lot of yarn shops want the yarn knitted up into samples just so that they can show how the finished item will look. And you could be the person who does that. So you can go along to your local yarn shop and say, do you need knitters? Can I be one? Can I go on your waiting list? Or can I actually do some knitting for you now? Go along very subtly showing them how talented you are with your latest cardigan or something like that then you'll be on their books in no time. Now, the fourth way you may be able to make money from your knitting is to test patterns. If you follow, follow knitwear designers on Instagram, on Facebook, or even on Ravelry, in the Ravelry forums, they may say, I need a tester. You may not get that much money for it. You may not even get paid at all. It may just be that you get the pattern for free. So this is, sometimes you may get paid, sometimes you may just get the pattern for free. Um, but if you are someone who wants on-trend items, you want to get all the patterns first, then it's a great way to just be a bit of a winner in that respect. Like I said, you may not get a lot of money for it, but you will have the bonus of getting the pattern first and getting it for free. Now, I mentioned knitting for yarn stores, but I've also been on the list to knit up for larger companies such as Rowan, such as Serdar. I never actually um, took them up and said, yes, I'll do some knitting for you. I was asked to do it, but I said, actually, I've got far too much else to do designing my own things. So it didn't actually work out. But they, if you ring them up from their website, there's contact details, you could be one of their sample knitters. They will ask you to do a few things, probably just to show them your skills. But first, but if you're on the list and they need knitted items to, so they can photograph them for all the patterns, it can be that simple. And they need to test all the different sizes. They need to test the patterns. So you could be a knitter for one of the yarn manufacturers. And the sixth way. Now, this is something that could be great fun if you have a really creative streak and you love coming up with new ideas with your knitting. You like just picking up a ball of yarn and your needles and you like to start knitting. You could actually write those patterns out and sell the patterns. And you think about all the time that goes into creating a pattern because <laughs> a lot of time does to go into creating a pattern. You will get paid for that time um, as the years go by. 
Okay, I hope that was helpful. That was six tips about how you can get money from the world by loving your knitting. Right, I'll see you next week. If you'd like to learn more about knitting for profit, then I'll put the link in below. I do have a course that, it, that goes into the subject much more deeply. Um, if you'd like to go and have a look at that, then it's in the description. The link is there ready and waiting for you. Right, bye for now. I'll see you next week. Happy knitting.